Well, I got a new ukulele, and I'm just tickled to death. Um, it, I bought a very nice case. It's a hard shell case to protect it. And it's just beautiful. It's a mainland. And it is solid mahogany. It has gold tuners on it. I believe a rosewood neck. It's, it's just so pretty. It is a cutaway. I got one with the uh, rope on it, the rope trim. I didn't, know, I didn't think I would like that until I got there and saw it. And when I say got there, I drove three and a half hours to Nashville, Indiana. And I was met by two of the nicest people in the world. And they let me play all the different ones. And it was, it was amazing because online you can see the difference between, uh, let's say, a cedar or a maple or a koa or whatever it happens to be. But they had several different ones in stock. Tenors. Um, concerts. Sopranos. Baritones. Uh, it was just, it's in a barn, and it's it's a wonderful place. And the town itself is amazing. I had no idea. Uh, little bitty, kind of a touristy town. Tons of shops. Um, I had a Maisai uh, pickup installed on it, which I'm also very happy with. I didn't know if I would be. I play it with my Behringer amplifier, which is 15 watts, but it's in the house I don't go over the number two and it's loud so uh, lots of sustain uh, beautiful tone and it comes with Aquila strings on it I had a low G put on it I played those for a while but uh, I've switched it over right now I've, I've got my living waters back on which are kind of my standard go-to so I'm sure you'd like to hear it and here we go <laughs> Well, that's my mainland tenor uke. Uh, it's a cutaway. It's mahogany, solid mahogany, and it's really nice. Uh, I mean, quality-wise, I was um, there while they were setting up ukes, and it's amazing. <laughs> I mean, Mike's wife is, she knows exactly what to do and how to do it, and I'm just watching her in amazement. Um, a good ear, um, 
they set the action very low, um, but not so low. It's going to buzz. It's just it's easy to press and and uh, very comfortable. Uh, they sound good. Now the thing about being there is um, they have mahogany and uh, cedar tops and uh, I think spruce there, all of which are solid, and you can take the same ukulele, but the different uh, types of wood with the same strings and listen to them. And, and you really, you actually can see a difference and hear a difference. It, it's fun. Um, I like mahogany. It's, it's very warm. And by warm, I just mean it's not tingy. Um, it, it, it probably doesn't sound as Hawaiian as the other ones, but, uh, I really do like it. And I, I couldn't be happier. This, this ukulele is just, it's amazing. Price-wise, they're, they're very low. <clears throat> For what you get, they're very competitive. The Baisai pickup, it's awesome. Uh, if you're not familiar with it, it is a pickup. Instead of adding a battery, you get a little charger for it. And you plug it in for 60 seconds. And you get approximately 16 hours of play time, and then you do it again. Uh, Mike made a point to let me know that uh, you can't overcharge it. it. You don't have to worry about it if you leave it in five minutes or whatever. Unplug it, it's, it's fine. It, it won't hurt a thing. Um, it came charged. I haven't charged it yet. Uh, I haven't got 15 hours in it, but I'm, I'm having, I'm having a lot of fun and, uh, I don't think you'd be disappointed. Uh, give, it's called Mainland Uke and it's in Nashland, uh, Nashville, Indiana, a very unique little town, but, uh, give them a call. They ship out daily and, uh, or you can give an email, but uh, just check it out. Thanks a lot.